Hello, my name is Andrew Brazier and I'm Head of Department for Creative FE at WCG Evesham Campus. I'm going to talk to you a little bit about why you might want to come and study a creative course with us at Evesham. First of all, why might you want to study a creative course at all? Well, as the employment marketplace continues to change, there are some fears that some jobs may start to become redundant through things like computerisation, um, automation, outsourcing work overseas, whatever it might be. Now there's one skill area that's kind of protected from that and that is creativity. If you are a creative person then you are going to be able to adapt to change effectively. You are going to be able to problem solve, you'll be able to you're able to think critically and you're able to be imaginative. And I'm yet to hear of any robot uh, or computer that can replicate those same things that a human can do. Uh, so until that happens, uh, being a creative person means that you uh, have a really good range of skills for life, but also for the employment sector as well. So with that in mind, uh, what creative course choices do we have at Evesham College? Well, we've got uh, a couple of key sort of program area lines. So first of all, there is uh, graphics and photography courses. So we have those at level two and at level three and an HG option as well. Um, so those courses introduce you to all of the uh, core skill areas of graphic design and photography. Uh, we have a photo studio at Evesham College and obviously a couple of computer rooms filled uh, with all the latest hardware and software that you need to be able to create digital graphics. Uh, and then the other program area we have at Evesham College is brand new for September 2020 and that is our level three diploma in eSports and IT. So eSports is a really interesting new area, up and coming and a uh, um, experiencing huge growth both in this country and overseas. So eSports is competitive gaming, um, but this course is all about all aspects of eSports and its operation. So it's not a, game, uh, it's not a course about uh, becoming an eSports player as such. Um, it does cover a bit of that, but it's more about the overall organization of eSports teams and eSports events. So there's a number of units on things like marketing, putting on an eSports competition, team management, um, advertising, game design and development and all of that sort of stuff. So if you're interested in eSports as a subject then this is definitely a course you should be looking at. In the second year of that course you move to more IT specific subjects so that's looking at things like computer hardware and software, um, setting up and operating networks, website building and design, and that sort of stuff. So across the two years you cover firstly the eSports angle and then the sort of IT angle as well. So that's a brand new course for September 2020. There's not going to be many colleges in the country that are offering that course and this is a really exciting opportunity for Evesham campus. Um, whichever course it is you come to us to do, uh, you perhaps might be thinking about what you do next and where it leads to. So if you come onto a level two course, then obviously you have the opportunity to progress on to the next level within um, the college. So moving up from level two to level three. If you come onto a level three course, then you might be thinking about moving on to university um, uh, or studying an HE course with us at WCG. Either way, the course team will support you through that process, help you build a portfolio that's gonna be really impressive when it comes to interview time and guide you through the whole application procedure as well. So you've got plenty of choices as to uh, where you take the course and what you do afterwards. I hope that explains a little bit about what we have in the creative field at Evesham Campus. If you have any further questions, please do talk to the marketing team and they can answer them for you. And I really hope I get to meet you in September. Thanks very much for your time.